Hi everyone, welcome back. You're here with Ash. Today we're going to be watching Jojo's Bizarre Adventure Stone Ocean episode 11. Yes, episode 11. We're continuing the part that we finished off last time. It is a two-parter episode. And in the last episode, Jolene was able to contact the Speedwagon Foundation to return her father's disc that would be able to spare and save his life. But to do so, she has to work together with Emporio, a new ally weather report, and face off a new stand user that has zero gravity abilities. They have 20 minutes to get a disc delivered to the Speedwagon Foundation. Can they do it? I guess we're about to find out. I've been waiting quite a bit to get into this episode. I'm really excited. Excited, so let's do it. Let's watch episode 11. Uh oh. This is gonna be really bad. How are they gonna explain this? Oh, Father Pucci. Okay, sure you do. 20 years, quite a track history. I wonder who it was 20 years ago. What are we setting to the factory? <gasps> Never mind. It's only been seven minutes. That means I have 13 minutes to go. Uh, no way. <laughs> Seriously, Jolene? It's the zero gravity. You know, you can just say P, Jolene. Must be so awkward. What? Are you kidding me? Okay, Jolene's going to Wait, where did he get rid of them? Blood? Oh crap, wait. What the hell? Oh crap. They're being attacked. This is very bad. This is a horribly dangerous stand. This is literally a space episode. Oh god. <laughs> he just has a box of nuts and screws to basically fire them. Can I freeze it? This is a really cool episode. The physics alone in this season has been spectacular. <laughs> I love this. Made spacesuit out of clouds. This is really cool. Two minutes, I need to beat this punk. Which means they're probably ten minutes away from going to the courtyard. Father Pucci is definitely gonna make this difficult. Yeah. That's a really good indication. It's almost like if they touch enough, whatever's not floating will probably be a culprit of Jumping Jack Spark. あの敵よ。あいつ。どうやって真空中で呼吸をしているの?やつの血液だってブクブクと沸騰しちまうんじゃないの?あれは射程距離なのよ。Let's go. I mean they're relying on each other to get through this. He has to be able to thrust them out. Ooh, ooh, what an ability. That's so cool. Like, if she ever suffers any fatal wounds, she could stitch herself back up. Let's go. Oh, no. 
A leak in a suit. This is so cool. She's like the anchor for his spacesuit. Oh no. I'm a little scared about the recoil. Like, what if it hits him? Nice. I love that. Is he gonna change up the game? Oh no. He's maybe trying to make a projectile with a barrel. It's gonna explode. Oh god. Zero gravity? That's scary. Oh no. He just needs to push off something. Come on. No, his blood is boiling. Save him, Jolene. She's catching him. Let's go, Jolene. She's just counting on him and everything right now like she's willing to risk her life if he can do it she has this she got this rats it's oh god they're like little blood bombs that's awful <laughs> No, oh, come on, come on, come on, come on. Well, I mean, she could probably use Stone Ocean anyways. Oh, God. Oh, yeah, but can you escape from this prison? What's he promised? I think you're underestimating Father Pucci here. Ooh, the thread is in his rotator. That's so cool. She caught every single one of the projectiles. She can basically pull herself to him now. Go, 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 go. <gasps> She's gonna destroy him? Oh my god. Oh my god. That's awful. That's really awful. <laughs> Brutal, Jolene. I guess once he dies, it's all over. I can't believe he's willing to risk this. God, he's a scumbag. He is a sexist and misogynist, probably. <laughs> really? Oh god. Oh god, her whole suit. Where's weather report? There he is. Oh no! No, 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 no! No! Not the second time this season! Please don't die. <laughs> nice. Yeah, but now Stone Ocean is too close. 
私の方に吹き戻してくれてるぞおらおらおらおらおらおらおらおらおらおらおらおらおらおらおらおらおらおらおらおらおらおらおらおらおらおらおらおらおらおらおらおらおらおらおらおらおらおらおらおらおらおらおらおらおらおらおらおらおらおらおらおらおらおらおらおらおらおらおらおらおらおらおらおらおらおらおらおらおらおらおらおらおらおらおらおらおらおらおらおらおらおらおら no. <laughs> She's a Joestar, right? I mean, once we have like Jotaro back in order, even if his memories are not accessible, that would be a good thing. He can help out. I'm so glad he didn't die. <laughs> Father Pucci? Father Pucci. Has to be Father Pucci. Oh god. Oh no. 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 Punch him. Punch him. Don't have mercy on him because he's a father. Punch him. Do it, Jolene. Punch him! Just do it! No hesitation. Oh, come on. No. No. Oh, she should have really hooked him up. It doesn't even matter at this point. Like, prisoner, prison guard. It doesn't matter because the whole objective at this point is to just get the disc back to Speedwagon Foundation while the window is still there. I don't know why she would have hesitated there and probably because she's a good person and she's not the kind of person that would just hurt someone who's innocent. I don't know. I feel like that's the price that you have to pay in a situation like that. I'm really, really worried because... They might actually find out that he's Pale Snake, he might have to reveal his stand, or he's gonna play dumb. Either way, things are not good for her and she's probably not gonna be able to get her way. So I only have to wonder, what is Jolene gonna do in these like last two to three minutes to get the disc back to Sweet Dragon Foundation? And what if it doesn't make it? That is an even scarier thought. Really, really stressful, but we have one episode remaining. So if you've been here to watch JoJo's Bizarre Adventure with me, please do subscribe, like, and comment. I would love to have you along for more and the rest of this entire series. And who knows, I am starting to think of what we will do next, what we will watch next, because there's a lot of anime that is um, on my backlog of things to get through. But we'll find out. So thanks for joining me for this bizarre adventure, and I'll see you next time. Thank you.